Hey there, Cancers. It's Age Rizzy, also known as the Sweetest Spiritual Gangsta. I'm back with another message of love. This is for you and your person and what's going on for the next um, 72 hours. So this weekend, we're going to see what's kind of going on Friday, Saturday, Sunday. All right. So if this resonates, definitely like, share and subscribe. If it doesn't, definitely check out um, the all signs reading that I will be posting as well. I am also doing Libra, Capricorn, and Leo because you guys got the most views this week. So thank you again for all of your likes, shares, and subscribes. All right, but let's get into it. I'm just going to take a little sip, a little song. And let's get into it, okay? Let's see, who do we have for all of my cancers? What's going on for all of my cancers, please? <clears throat> what are some warnings this weekend for all of my cancers? Sun, moon, or rising signs? Show me for all of my cancers. What are cancers' warnings? What are cancers' warnings for this weekend? A very quick bonus message. Show me um, what we need to see. Show me what else we need to see for the quick bonus message. All right, for their warnings. For the next 72 hours, okay, show me overall energy. So let's see what we have here for all my cancers. We have crown, honor and respect will, will come to you, okay, cancer? So know that maybe someone's looking some at you in more of a uh, respectable aspect, okay, more of a 30, authority figure vibes, all right? But I do feel like respecting yourself will mirror that energy of others wanting to respect you, wanting to honor you. Show me what else. We do have triumph over troubles, obstacles, okay? So I do feel like you're actually really, I feel like you're cutting down a lot of, um, you're getting past a lot of things, okay? I feel like someone's just seeing you as very, very strong, all right? I feel like people are seeing you as strong, seeing you as very resilient. Like, even if people try to hurt you, like, you still come out on top. Even if people try to really give you that bad energy, you still come out on top. Something about you is really triumphing. And I feel like also people are seeing that. I see that people see that you are a little doubted, okay, Leo? And I do feel like people, not Leo, you could be dealing with a Leo or you could have, like, a Leo rising or a Leo moon, okay? But I do feel, or a Leo, whatever, it doesn't matter, Leo sun, you could have like a cancer moon or rising, but I do feel as if you are um, really digging deep in what it comes to your self-confidence and knowing what you desire, knowing your worth. Show me what else here. Yes, we do also have a meeting with a stranger could be important. So maybe you do have to maybe meet someone for legal matters, someone that's in authority, okay? Or I do feel like maybe you're meeting with a stranger, okay? Someone that does want to meet with you, work with you of some sort. You could be meeting someone over the internet, all right? Coming into um, something, so I feel like something's coming into fruition that maybe you've been manifesting, okay? Maybe you've been manifesting, maybe trying to meet someone. Maybe you're just trying to bring over issues when it comes to love and you're finally meeting someone new, okay? But I do feel like... Um, maybe getting out and doing things right now because meeting a stranger might be very important and you're only going to do that if you get out of the house so i feel like maybe possibly just go outside do your thing i feel like also i feel like just represent yourself strongly right now i feel like that's something that's very important okay and i feel like also don't own your struggles so much i just feel like yes own them but don't be your struggle okay let the struggle be a part of maybe something that you have a part of your life but that's not who you are that's not what's made you you have made you okay um but yes show me what else we yeah we have good fortune i do feel a very lucky energy for you cancer coming out a very good energy okay um this is my second time actually recording this i'm not gonna lie i kept getting cut off my i had no space on my phone and the energy that i was getting before was a very sad energy a very um you know down energy and i do feel now in this energy th this is about someone that is really standing in their power knowing their power show me what else is going on here yes we have vine seek out information that will help you so i do feel like maybe seeing um this meeting the stranger with someone or meeting up with someone in general seeking out information from people that maybe know different than you but that maybe you don't know them maybe you're gonna have to step out of your comfort zone when it comes to asking questions etc etc but i do feel like there's a time and a period for everything and that's going to be coming up soon when it comes to you gaining information about certain things and aspects that are going on in your life certain opinions okay moves whatever overall we have happiness and well-being i'm telling you once you get past certain problems and issues things are going to be looking very up okay 
I do feel a very positive energy right now. This is definitely for a, a cancer that's in alignment, okay? That is really trying to, I feel like, be their higher and best version of themselves. If you've been negative, if you've been not positive, if you've been, you know, not being your higher self, and then that's not you, okay? And I think maybe that's the energy you need to tune into. But yes, overall, we do have a younger man. Dealings or relationship with a younger man. So you could be the younger man, okay? Or you could be dealing with someone of a younger age, okay? Age bracket. Split the deck. Ooh, we do have get back to the basics. Sorry, I totally hit my camera. So we do have get back to the basics. I do feel like maybe the simple things in life, I feel like you're getting back to, you're maybe making a new morning routine. You're making new things that I feel like new tendencies, new patterns that you want to, new habits. I feel like you're trying to cancel all the old ones, the ones that aren't helping you, and you're trying to really obtain better ones. And I do feel like it's actually helping you. You getting past the issues, the troubles, and really using it to catapult you. Top of the deck coming in, fair man. So dealings are a relationship with a failed man. So they could have blonde gray or white hair all right they could definitely be of a lighter skin tone um maybe older in age okay or they could be young and just they have a lot of facial hair a little scruffy okay but i do feel like this person could be prominent okay yeah but we do have problems to be resolved so this person you could have an issue with okay or you could be this young man okay that may have some type of issue that you have to get past again we do have period of frustration lessons to be learned for the overall energy here split the deck but victory and some endeavors so again like i said triumphing over these issues triumphing over these frustrating periods split the deck again yes in need of help assistance or guidance so again like i said seeking out that information that will help you is going to be very important do not um be held back i feel like sometimes maybe some cancers are reserved and asking questions a little fearful but i do feel like there's a sense of you needing to step out of that and really gaining more of a positive perspective knowing that you asking questions doesn't mean that you're stupid it means just you're curious and that you want an answer and once you have your answer now you have an answer to give to others if they have that same question okay so i feel like knowledge is power okay which is very important right now but overall you will be taking care of in difficult times okay so that is one thing that i feel like you do need to remember you are taken care of you are good okay but it is time to i feel like exit some type of situation that might not be the best for you okay so take that as it goes i feel like what Whatever maybe is in an alignment with your energy within this retrograde. I feel like it's being exposed. So I do feel like whatever situations those are, it's time to exit, okay? But let's see what your person wants to say to you now. For your bonus message, okay, for your weekend bonus message regarding cancer and their person, what does cancer's person feel for cancer? Apology. You can expect the apology that you want to hear soon. Okay. What are they maybe apologizing for, Cancer's person? What is uh, Cancer's person apologizing for? Side dude, okay. So I do feel like this could be definitely a masculine cancer, okay? I feel like someone maybe had been a side dude. Maybe made someone made you as a side dude, okay? I don't know. But there's someone that's apologizing for having maybe a possible third party, okay? Or putting you in a third party. All right, show me what else is going on. Why is this apology here for all of my... Uh, cancers from their person this love is only emotional dependence okay so someone's wanting to apologize for making you maybe only a necessity for when they emotionally need you okay only hitting you up when i feel like look again they need you um i feel like but it's emotionally maybe it, they like to emotionally i feel like manipulate you they use certain tactics i feel like you for you to bend to their women some way and i do feel like this person's maybe apologizing for that okay i can't help it that i'm toxic baby lol <laughs> oh hell no but yeah i feel like this person does see themselves i feel like maybe there was a sense of a mirror that was shown towards them um, I don't know if karma hit or if they were just shown something, but shown something. But I do feel like they do want to apologize and make something right towards you. We have brown skin. Okay, so this person could have brown skin. All right, um, light brown, dark brown doesn't matter, but they do have brown, uh, a brown um, skin tone. Show me what else possibly is their energy for their person. Why do you treat me like this? Yeah, so I do feel like this person also wants to, I feel like they wonder why you do treat them the way they do. Oh, oh they, I feel like they wonder why you treat them the way that you do, okay? I feel like they wonder why you maybe keep them at a certain distance or at only a certain part of your life, okay? Why do they feel this way though? Why do they feel like you treat them in a certain way for cancer's person? That's enough, yeah. So yeah, so I feel like, 
I feel like also maybe it's more so maybe you ask why this person treats you that way. So I do feel like maybe they want to apologize towards you. Okay. But I do feel like also maybe they feel a certain way. Okay. And I feel like they, they know that maybe it's enough. It's enough. It's okay. That's enough. It needs to stop. We also do have speak up already, right? When that wanted to fly out, um, I caught it. Okay. But I do feel like this person definitely wants to know some things. W what do they want to know the most? I'd rather be single. Okay, yeah. So I do feel like this person does um, want to know if you would rather be single because I do feel like that's kind of an energy that I feel like they either feel that you're in or their character projecting, wondering if that's how you're feeling. Because again, with I can't help it that I'm toxic, baby, I fear it's a mirror thing that maybe you guys both don't want anything that is not tangible, that's not worth it anymore. I feel, I feel like maybe that's been something that's been an issue, um, knowing discernment whether or not some of things should continue or end. We also have, I don't know how you feel about me, so IDK, how to feel for you. Exactly, like I said. I feel like it's a mirrored energy like, well, we want each other, but then we don't want each other, okay? I feel like, again, only emotional fulfillment comes in with each other. For some reason, you guys definitely satisfy the other person, whether it's physical or emotional. Show me what else we have. Give you my space, I'll come to you. So again, like I said, that apology that you want to hear soon, it is coming, Cancer. I feel like, what are they apologizing for? What do, what do they have to apologize for? expensive cologne okay so this is someone that wears expensive cologne someone that's has an expensive taste okay this is an energy we're tuned into okay someone that smells really good all right someone that just is, yeah what else we have i'm tired of repeating myself yeah so i do feel like this person definitely wants to respond i feel like maybe this person this person could be the side piece or you could be the side piece. i don't know take the roses like goes. whatever but I do feel like whoever, the one that does have more of an expensive taste does really have, I feel like they dress well, they smell good, they really take care of themselves. They have a very high um, expectation of themselves, okay? This person wants to apologize to you because I feel like either they know that they've been repeating themselves about the same thing, like, oh, I don't want something serious or I want something serious. I don't know who, whoever is more of the non-committal energy, okay, is what I'm getting, they want to apologize for, I feel like, putting you in that predicament. But I do feel like also, I feel like they don't want to keep repeating themselves about what they want to desire or what they do or what they don't want. I feel like, I don't know. Show me what else. Show me what else. Right, are you going to take me seriously? Yeah, that's the one thing. I feel like the one thing about this person is maybe they've already told you once, one too many times about what they do feel for the connection. Um, I do feel like also maybe in a way they know that maybe you could be dating other people, okay, with this only being on about one thing, you know, sometimes there's only just emotional, emotional, there's no physical, there's no, I need you in my life because you make me feel solid, you make me feel like I need something, like, I, well, I feel like maybe that is what the energy is, but I feel like there's no real divine love, it's all like a codependent energy, there's no genuine I really want to be with you because I'm in love with you, okay? I feel like it's I, I love you, but I'm not in love with you type of energy is what I'm in, okay? We also have, I understand your situation, but I'm done, yeah. So I do feel like maybe you could have the brown skin, okay? D depending on who you are, but I do feel like when it comes to the situation, you guys are both kind of clocking out because... I do feel like someone has been like, okay, well, I get why you don't feel away or you don't want to take anything serious or you don't, but I feel like someone's kind of clocking out of that. Why are they clocking out? Show me. I can't put my words into actions. Yeah. So again, I feel like someone just feels like this only goes so far. Something about the dynamic only goes so far. What what only goes so far though? Can you guide me to that? nurse cna hospital worker okay so i feel like someone could be a cna someone could work in the hospital someone could do some type of health department work um someone could maybe be married or in a relationship with someone and again created them to be a side dude possibly okay um i mean that could be for a short few or i just feel like there's someone that maybe someone works with that keeps someone as a side dude but someone i mean they don't have to be a nurse but someone this could be like in a work environment Okay, yes, there's no trust, yeah. Someone doesn't trust the other person to take them serious enough. but And I feel like that's because maybe there's a third party. Because if you're a side dude, that means there's a main piece, okay, somewhere. Confirm what side dude is representing. We do have some time I'm running out of things to talk about with you. Yeah, so I do feel like also this there's the chemistry, like I said, only goes so far, okay? I do feel like this person... Um, 
again it's all emotional dependence okay emotional things emotional emotional confirm these messages please confirm these messages sorry i'm trying to shuffle confirm these messages please confirm these more messages okay i wish you'd open up to me right so i do feel like this person does feel like gonna close up energy so why else does this person want cancer to open up to them tattoos okay so this person could definitely have tattoos okay show me what else is going on here show me what else is going on here friendship okay this friendship is leading to more all right we also have i want you to get your own life yes yeah. so again like i said someone is very consumed with the other person something is very imbalanced okay something is very imbalanced but i do feel like someone is a little too entitled to wanting something more or, or wanting to know what is going on more i feel like this is something that either has continued for a long time or it's short i intuitively feel like it's been a short time or time span nothing's too serious for someone to be able to get entitled on yeah again i'm stalking your past exes old jobs old friends yeah so i do feel like this is a new person that's in someone's life okay and they're dating but i feel like they want to know more about them and it's like they're forcing their hand to like be like, okay, well, I want you to do this for me. I want you to do this for me. And I want, but I feel like so, the love only goes so far because it's like, well, I can't, I can't let you get that close to me, you know? And I feel like someone's like, well, why do you treat me like this? Why do you treat me like a side piece? Why do you treat me as if like I can't get anything deeper than just this? Confirm this for me, Cancer's person. Old woman, yeah. So I do feel like this is maybe an older woman, okay? Again, maybe a more mature person, okay? I do feel like maybe there's a side piece, okay? A younger a younger man with an older woman. Yes, we do have Saturday. So something could have happened this Saturday, okay, coming up. Or I feel like this energy is going to be very prominent tomorrow, okay? Um, or maybe last Saturday something was very important. And I feel like maybe this apology is coming in this Saturday now right we also have i know more than you think right mm. so why do they feel like they know more than they think why does this person feel like they know more about cancer than they think they do what is going on here feelings not mutual yeah so this person <laughs> this person they think they know more than they think than you think they do cancer so they think that they know that you don't want them that it's it's not that you you're not in love with them they know and they know that maybe you want other things with another person and i feel like they know that maybe you're annoyed with them that's why you're taking your space right i want to trust you but you give me reasons not to exactly yeah so i do feel like this person is just getting very emotionally defensive on things what is the advice show me what's some advice for what is going on here in the dynamic towards cancer and their person less actions and more words so you guys need to i feel like stop um trying to show people and do things physically but just talk talking will be very important instead of trying to show someone all right no gifts no no try to do third party actions like when i say third party third party interference is like using outside materialistic things to improve this that's not what's going to happen i feel like more words would actually help you guys more intellect okay we have three weeks and we also have players so i do feel like maybe someone has been going this is going on for three weeks and i do feel like someone's getting more so a player energy like someone's not declaring certain things okay and i feel like also in three weeks maybe you know someone wants to throw in their their towel confirm what three weeks in player is can you confirm what this is please guide me i want you to take me serious yeah i do feel like someone was a player and i feel like they don't want to play a player no more someone wants to like throw in the towel or declare some things okay confirm some messages let's confirm these overall nothing has changed since i or you left okay so again like i said there was a separation and i feel like this person's coming back and i feel like someone's wondering if maybe someone had one um has started something new but i feel like nothing's changed okay this person's still the same show me what else we have i'm ready to settle down now i'm telling you this person is just really serious about you okay cancer i feel like maybe it started off to not being serious but now it is okay this is definitely for maybe an older woman dealing with a younger person we also have sudden progress and change coming out this week, okay? This weekend. Show me what else is loss issues. So again, a lot of maybe abandonment issues, okay? Mean uh things being taken away or out of access, okay, to someone. And I feel like that's where the progress and change is coming in. All right. Show me what else. Self-sufficient. Again, yes. Moving forward self-sufficiently. Show me what else end of a learning phase yeah so i do i feel like end of a learning cycle yeah 
I do feel like someone is getting past a certain phase and cycle that they've been on in their life. And I definitely feel like it's just because they're maybe choosing themselves in the dynamic. Okay, yeah, craftsmanship. They're building up their own. I feel like mutually, this is going to build up you guys both as people individually. Okay, I don't know how else to say it, but I feel like it's like self-work, self-shadow work right now, right? Helping others, mentoring, renewing faith. So it's like you guys are helping renew each other's faith right now in love, okay, for each other's dreams to come true. Again, end of a learning cycle. I think, yeah, the decisions that you're about to make regarding this person is going to help both parties, okay? But I do feel like, again, using those words instead of trying to show someone, I feel like words of affirmations is very important right now. We have family support and balanced partnership. So I do feel like maybe you guys are using your family to be able to tell you about yourselves or you're using people that are close to you that love you to help I feel like balance out you as a person and you as a partner in relationships split the deck loss of love yeah so I do feel like maybe I don't know you guys needing to take take some time away to come back together are you taking yourself out of the dynamic totally to come to, together I don't know but there is a new inspiration that is being brought in all right so let's get uh some quick messages now some quick messages and that was your reading it is safe for you to love, open to receive the highest energy of all, okay? Open your heart up. We also have calling in your soulmate, all right? Your prayers and affirmations and visualizations will bring you together. We also have wedding. This situation does involve marriage. So again, like I said, I did feel like maybe someone was married. All right, let's confirm this. It's safe for you to love. Yes, yeah, so open. keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. And even if they are different, it is safe for you to love someone that is different from you. Okay, Cancer. What is calling in your soulmate? Top of the deck. Okay, chemistry. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. We also have, there's a magnetic attraction here. So I do feel like you're ascending. It's not that you're getting engaged. Maybe you are. But I do feel like it's it's more so your love life is ascending to something that you've been desiring. Um, you know, that's more positive. That's more in alignment with your energy and love. Okay? Overall, true love. This is a romance of a lifetime. So again, I do feel like you're manifesting someone that was supposed to be on your level in love. Okay? And they are coming in. So be aware and get ready. Show Tell me what this situation involves marriage top of the deck give your relationship a chance work on your partnership so i do feel like maybe there's a sense of maybe someone backing out of this because maybe they want to work out their marriage okay someone is wearing a false mask so i do feel like maybe the side piece whoever's the side piece in the dynamic sorry i hit the camera but I do feel like you have to realize maybe someone has been with someone for a very long time. And I do feel like there is real love here. I feel like someone's been together with their person since maybe they were in high school. And I feel like there's a sense of them really wanting to work on the partnership. And that is something that's going down. And that's why you do need to realize like, yeah, this person also has kids with them. Okay, so I do feel like it makes it a little more you know hard to kind of get out of yeah top of the deck for yourself it's time to take control back of your life though cancer so let's see what else yeah as you release and heal the past you will experience more love in the present moment so i do feel like in a sense this person needs to figure out whether or not they're going to keep working on the partnership and the marriage with that they're in or if they're going to let go of things okay or maybe there's something about a marriage maybe you guys are married and maybe you found out someone had a side piece and someone wants to apologize okay take it as it goes but i do feel like someone does want to take the other person serious but there are some limitations overall we do have express your love go ahead and make the romantic gesture get to know each other okay as you reveal yourselves you will uh your bond will deepen but the reconciliation even if you separate it's going to come back i do feel like it's time to i feel like take some alone time and figure out what you guys do desire with each other okay because you are lovable you do deserve love all right let's see what spirit has for this spirit says yes okay yes what spirit to romance recovery so yeah i do feel like you guys both need to recover you both need to heal some things okay i feel like again apology someone needs to just let the other person smooth things out and talk it out okay that's what's needed overall within the next few weeks yeah definitely try to recover and heal certain things within the next few weeks don't take things too serious right now let's get one more yeah, not today. So the next move for this person is not dealing, avoiding conversation, call, boundaries. Someone is still angry, okay? So I feel like maybe by Saturday, um, someone's going to apologize or maybe Sunday or Monday. Let's get one more for this person's emotions. Yeah, heart with the key. They feel like they met the one. They want to open their heart and get together. They, things, they want things to be perfect. Overall, one more. Ooh, two. Yes, we do have mirroring energy, yeah. So I do feel like you guys are both, both, 
Blah. You guys are both very worried about the other person, the other woman or the other man in the dynamic. I feel like that's one thing that you guys are both mirrored your or mirroring your energy about. Okay, this third person, this third, this other energy, because I feel like you guys are both avoiding each other because of that energy. Okay, let's get some root advice. What does all my cancers need to hear? You need to get over yourself, pull your shit together, help people, give back, and do good shit for humanity. We also have put the fucking phone down, all right? Too much scream time is making you awkward and sad. Go talk to a live person. And also ask an expert, all right? Don't rely on your friends on the internet and listen to a damn professional. So I do feel like maybe you should be getting some solid advice from people that know what they're talking about. I think that's going to be a very important, all right? Let's get where you're, uh, what this person's next moves are. And that was your reading. Next person's moves, okay? This next um, 72 hours for all of my cancers the fool ten of cups yeah so this person i feel like they're definitely going to leap in towards you because you are their biggest wish fulfillment all right i feel like they literally if you even if you have kids i feel like this person wants to take on kids and and partnerships okay but the only thing is they are still turning a blind eye to the truth of the dynamic they're 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 closing themselves off to the thoughts that they really do have because they all they want to do is be happy with you but they are having some internal issues okay about their own fulfillment and their own happiness there is causing there is a sense of um anxiety about if they're going to get their their happiness chosen okay yeah i do feel like they they're scared that they're fighting for something that might not actually happen or they're staying and, and being consistent yeah i feel like they're just really waiting literally with the four of wands i feel like something about them is really waiting and hoping that things will smooth through and i feel like that is what they're manifesting okay this could be a pisces cancer or a scorpio or literally that king of cups could be you all right, but I feel like they're trucking along. They're taking their time coming in. Top of the deck, three of swords. Yeah, again, that third party energy. They're taking their time, okay? But that was for you. Let's get one message for you. And that was your message. Honesty, yes. I feel like it's a time to be honest and look in the mirror, all right? I feel like the both of you guys, this is a cross watcher walking. It's time watching. <laughs> There's time. It's a time to look in the mirror, okay? It's a time to be honest with yourself and with others, okay? The, honest, the, the truth will set you free, basically. But that was for you. I hope that helps. I'll be back with another message very soon. Stay safe. Stay happy, guys. Love ya. See you later.